Hi, I'm Dr. Suvarshla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. Ziva Fertility is conducting a free camp for patients suffering from infertility. We are conducting this camp in the month of May on every Saturday at Kompalli, Sanatnagar, Banjara Hills and Manikonda. Included in this camp are free registration, consultation, counseling and semen analysis. Subsequent treatment options will also be uh, suggested to you and you can avail this opportunity. Hi, I am Dr. Suvarshla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. What is retrograde ejaculation? What causes the issue and how can we solve it? Do we have any solutions for patients suffering from retrograde ejaculations? Let's look at this topic for today. Retrograde ejaculation is a condition where the semen does not come out of the body through the penis but goes back into the bladder. Now remember that when sperms are produced into the testis, they travel a long distance through the vast difference through the prostate seminal vesicles and uh, instead of going into the bladder when they pass through the urethra, they come out through the penis. Now there is a muscle around the bladder which constricts and does not allow the semen to get into the bladder. In patients with retrograde ejaculation, this semen does not come out. On the other hand, because of the weak muscles at the neck of the bladder, the semen goes into the bladder and therefore there is no ejaculate. In such patients, there is very little semen seen or there is no semen at all. This condition is also called as aspermia and retrograde ejaculation is uh, one of the reasons for aspermia patients. Now let us see the causes behind retrograde ejaculation. Maybe your previous prostate or urethral surgery is the reason behind this retrograde ejaculation. Radiation therapy also causes retrograde ejaculation. Diabetes could be one of the reasons. The patient could be on numerous drugs, maybe psychosomatic drugs or also recreational drugs which could be causing this problem. There must have been a nerve damage which led to the muscle relaxing around the bladder which is why the semen is then going into the bladder and not coming out through the penis. So this, these are few reasons why retrograde ejaculation could be occurring in a patient. Now what are the symptoms of retrograde ejaculation? Well the most important symptom that you can observe if you are suffering from retrograde ejaculation is that there could be no semen at all. So aspermia is one of the biggest and the easiest symptom to catch. Second one is that after ejaculation the urine which is passed could be cloudy. This is because the semen then went into the bladder which is the reason behind this cloudy urine. So that is another very big symptom. Mostly infertility is also one of the symptoms because the patient may not be aware that this retrograde ejaculation could also be causing infertility. So when they come up for workup, when we ask them their histories, their sexual lives, their, their other medical complications and this problem is relieved, we can then point a finger at the reason for male infertility. Well, the treatment options are many, but one of the most important is that we collect the urine sample, purify it, alkaline it and then we use the sample for assisted reproductive technologies. It's a very good um, procedure where success rate is very good. If you are suffering from retrograde ejaculation, please feel free to contact us. Thank you. We strive very hard to make these informative videos for you. Please encourage us by subscribing and liking our videos. Thank you.